Texans have continued to keep COVID under control, according to the governor. That's what he posted in a tweet yesterday that hinted he would allow more businesses to reopen soon. We showed it to you yesterday, and here it is again after praising the state's COVID-19 statistics. Abbott seemed to suggest that bars could be back in business soon. Abbott has not yet announced which businesses would be reopening. Meanwhile, in his weekly virtual briefing with Travis County Commissioners, Austin Travis County Interim Health Authority Dr. Mark Escott echoed much of what the governor wrote. He said that although there was a brief period of increased COVID-19 cases in the area last month, it has flattened out and has been that way for a while. The same is true for COVID-19 related hospitalizations. But it was another tweet. Not the governor's, but the president's that got Escott's attention. Today he responded to President Trump telling Americans not to be afraid of COVID-19. The evidence is clear that more than 200,000 Americans have died from COVID-19. That it is a dangerous disease that has killed more people than flu. I'm not sure why we have to continue to debate these topics. Yeah. The president has to understand that he is a leader. And as a leader, he must set an example for others. And when he does things like take his mask off and, and say that we shouldn't be afraid, it's sending a wrong message. Escott did talk about the dangers of large gatherings, including high school volleyball and football games. That hits close to home for students in the Round Rock ISD. Stony Point High School's football team will miss its next few games because of exposure. We'll have more about that coming up in our next half hour.